Hi everyone, Michelle here from Acrylic Mixology Art. Um, I'm going to do the top of this table. This is a metal table, like if you want to use it on a porch or a patio. And I'm going to do um, a color scheme similar to these uh, coasters that I did. I love this scheme. And I am a green, greenish blue kind of person. This uh, color in here. Hopefully, I haven't put resin on these. I'm just kind of waiting for them to cure. Hopefully, you can see the the green. This is probably my favorite shade of green, kind of this yellow green. Anyways, um, I'll use this color scheme and um, do these on this table. Not as a set or anything. I just like the color scheme. Sometimes what I find most challenging um, is picking color schemes, you know? I did, um, it ended up being about 296, no, 90, nope, it was almost 300 coasters, and I do sets of five. So I did, what, 30, 30 sets? It's crazy. I used the ceramic tiles. I tried using the wood, but it, I'm not about to finish or coat that many tiles or that many squares of wood and then paint over them too. I just, no. I'd rather just use the ceramic tiles and be done with it and then finish them on the back with the corking and the resin and stuff. So anyways, similar color scheme. This is um, Lagoon. I can't decide. If I want to do like the half and leave some of the table exposed or if I want to cover the whole thing. That's kind of my debate at this point. I don't know what I want to do. But anyways, uh, Sherwin Williams Lagoon. This is um, Titan Mars Pale. It's kind of a peachy color by Golden. It's very, it's very flat or matte, not flat. This is a... Uh, T.O.P. Rain. It's a pretty color. I threw this in here. This wasn't in the original coaster design. This is T.O.P. Asparagus. Just love this color. Even without the sparkly finish. I just love that color. And then the cell activator is uh, Indigo. Amsterdam Indigo. So, hang on. Let me debate. I kind of want to just do the strip again and leave the sides exposed, but I just, I love this color combo, which is why I think I want to add, um, I think I want to do the whole table. No, I'm going to do the whole table. It's fine. I'm going to do the whole table. I just need to use more color paint. I don't know what I want to do on the table, but... I'll just do it at an angle. That should be plenty. Yeah. All right. Um, I want it to be pretty heavily covered, so I'm going to use quite a bit of paint. This is very similar to, this is TLP Rain, very similar to uh, the base. Hopefully that doesn't throw the design.
I love the indigo against this asparagus. I think it's a gorgeous color combo. <clears throat> All right, let me blow this out. sit for a minute. So all the sand develop in there. I'll clean up, be right back. So I used the Titan Mars Pale as kind of my light color and it didn't disappoint on this. You probably can't see it on camera. Um, in person though, it is very a very pale peach. All my indigo is kind of disappearing and all the cells are forming. I'm going to torch this because there are a gazillion bubbles. And that's okay. And then the rain, this TLP rain, you can see how it's got that kind of greenish, I don't know. I'm, I'm glad I, I did this. I hope it fills out nicely. We shall see. Put some of this on the edge so it'll help it get there, but I hope I have enough paint. I might not. I might actually have to go in and, you know what, I'm probably going to do that now. I'm going to add just a small drizzle on each side. So I think it might need a little bit of help. I'm not one on my coaster sets. I only use two colors plus the pillow and the cell activator. I find that when you use too many, you just kind of lose the distinction and the prettiness of some of the colors. And you know, and if you use them more, that's fine. But I also kind of get heavy handed. So if I'm putting five or six, seven colors down on a tile, by the time it's all said and done, I've probably lost most of them or blown them off or whatever, you know. Just me. I have a love-hate relationship with tiles as it is. They are a great seller at my festivals. I sell out of them quite a bit or come very close to it. Um, but they are a lot of work. But what I find is, you know, people can't afford a piece of art or, you know, their money's needed elsewhere. They got their priorities and their budget. I totally get it. <clears throat> Getting a coaster set gives them that little bit of uniqueness and to where they feel like they have something really cool and artsy but and unique, different, can't find anywhere else, but not, doesn't break their bank kind of thing. So spin this out. <laughs> scraped up this access how things move to the sides
pretty sure that'll get tilted off anyways, I think. You know, I'm always worried about um, <laughs> getting to the sides on my canvases. It's, it's an issue on round things as well. I know these colors are not for everyone. I just, I think they're very soothing. You know, people think about beach colors. These kind of remind me of a lake, you know? So adding that to the sides, um, just help, well, I guess there's a little bit left there. I'll spin that again. Um, just helps the paint spread out more. You don't really mess up your design with it, so. I'm really not one for baby spins either. If I'm gonna spin it, I'm gonna spin it. Um, moves my paint quicker. Move that was. Yeah, I'm loving it. I am. The indigo, you can see it on the edges of there and over here. The indigo will definitely go back to being the right color once it dries. It does look very dark, but it is blue. I don't know what that is. I'll give it a go. I still see a lot of bubbles, a lot of air bubbles. <clears throat> once over. All right. Somehow managed to miss this one and all that. But that is okay, I guess. Yeah, the, the Aspen being very similar to the base coat that I didn't really realize until I put it down, um, gave it a shimmer in parts. So a little bit of a contrast, but not so distinct that doesn't work, doesn't blend well, but yeah, loving this. I'm so glad I uh, used this color combo. I wasn't going to, but I'm glad I did. You know, and if nobody else likes it, then I can just put it out on my patio. Hey. All right, I'll get you guys in for a close-up. Wouldn't it be so awesome if we could capture the sides on the canvas? Why is it sometimes you can really see that aspen in this area? Um, I've had paintings that I've done. They were they were okay, but man, the sides like that isn't that gorgeous? The sides were like, wow! I need to get that onto the canvas. You know, it's kind of comical. The uh, Titan Mars Pale gave it just enough lightness to where it's not heavily dark, more on the sides. So, anyways, I'm liking this a lot with my glare straight down the middle. Yay. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you're a subscriber, thank you very much. If you're not one, please consider subscribing. Um, Everybody have a wonderful day and uh, go mix it up. Thank you.